Well, I, I came over to this part of the building yesterday and, and saw um, the Qigong master um, giving a lecture, so I sat down quietly in the back, and when he finished speaking to the person he was working with, he asked for a volunteer, so I raised my hand. And he did a brief, he had a, a very short amount of time, he did a brief sort of um, a, a assessment of what it was he saw going on in me, and um, we didn't have the time to actually go into uh, a question and answer or any kind of recommendations of what he might have suggested would be helpful to me based on what he said. So that's what I was curious about speaking to him today because I felt like he he said some things that were certainly worthwhile hearing, but I had no idea how, what direction he would have taken with those things. Well, he said that um, that he could see that there was some um, strain, and I'm sorry, I don't recall the exact words he used, but there was some uh, difficulty in my uh, knee and lower legs, which is true, I have arthritis in my knee joints, and that he saw uh, some of the strain going from my lower back down my legs. And he also saw some uh, disruption in my lung area, and he said that my left hand, now my hands, unlike my knees, are usually very um, comfortable for me to use, and I use them a lot in my work, but when he started to describe it, I realized that I sometimes get some pain in this part of my hand, and he was saying, yes, that that's related to this group of muscles or tendons that uh, sort of extend from the, the thumb there. So that was all we got a chance to actually talk about. He also talked about some strain on my upper back shoulder area, which I know that I've always had like a, um, a spinal curvature in my upper back. So yeah, he, he I, I thought, accessed the information about what was going on. Uh, I would say that given that he didn't know me, he didn't have any uh, uh, documented history or information about how I was and he had literally just been in my company for a moment or two, it seemed that he had tuned in on some of the things that are chronic issues for me.